The coronavirus pandemic has had an effect on all kinds of businesses, both large and small. And as ABC 10 News reporter Steve Smith tells us, even something as sweet as chocolate has felt the impact. During this pandemic, maybe rich and creamy chocolate is the answer to happiness. Perfect. It's a tri-blend. It's got the dark, white and milk chocolate in there and a little bit of hazelnut. Daylene Coleman runs Delightful Chocolat in San Marcos, and she's fortunate to spend each day working with chocolate. It is hard for me. As soon as I get anything on me, I'm like, oh, <laughs> I'm a finger licker. Now, she's not a chocolate maker. She's what is known as a chocolatier. We all have our own little specialties. It's a way to express. You're taking the product and then you're creating with it. But while she continues to produce delectable chocolates, the pandemic has kind of put a sour taste in all her sweetness. I love to teach. That's been my passion. And um, we had to kind of stop our classes for the longest time. And also I work with wineries and that all stopped. And while Delightful Chocolat is continuing their online sales, they've now started a membership club to provide a little happiness to their customers. People wanted something to be able to still celebrate. And so that's how we came up with our boxes. And we started curating these boxes and we thought, well, instead of a one off, let's do a club. Let's make it so that every month we get to be creative and do something completely different. And the Box Chocolate Club offers different memberships with chocolates of your choice. In San Marcos, Steve Smith, ABC 10 News. Chef Daylene has restarted her in-person classes, but it is restricted to two to three people from the same household. Or to add chocolate in a movie.